In the realm of celebrity lifestyle, few stories can match Flex Alexander's compelling storytelling. From the heights of financial achievement to the winding paths of his career, each chapter of Flex Alexander's life tells a story of tenacity, strategic moves, and undeniable charisma. In this video, we unravel the layers of his net worth, go over the milestones of his illustrious career, and dissect the financial activities that have shaped his legacy. Let's dive in now. Flex Alexander, a multifaceted American entertainer, has carved his niche in the realms of acting, dance, and comedy. With a net worth estimated at $250,000, Alexander's journey to fame has been marked by versatility and resilience. His ascent began with appearances on various television sitcoms, gradually propelling him into the spotlight. However, it was his portrayal of the endearing single father, Flex Washington, on the UPN sitcom One on One, 2001-2006, that truly cemented his place in the entertainment industry. Beyond the small screen, Alexander's talent transcended into the realm of cinema, where he graced audiences with his presence in a multitude of films. His diverse roles included performances in Modern Vampires, 1998, The Force, 1999, Out Cold, 2001, Book of Love, The Definitive Reason Why Men Are Dogs, 2002, Gas, 2004, Snakes on a Plane, 2006, and Trigger, 2020. With each character, Alexander showcased his ability to adapt and captivate audiences across different genres. Recognition for Alexander's contributions to entertainment came in the form of prestigious awards. In 2003, he was honored with the NAACP Image Award for Outstanding Actor in a Comedy Series. The following year, Alexander's talent was celebrated once again at the BET Comedy Awards, where he clinched the title of Outstanding Actor in a Comedy Series, further solidifying his status as a distinguished figure in the world of comedy. Mark Alexander Knox, widely recognized by his stage name, Flex Alexander. Born on April 15, 1970, in New York City, he was the cherished son of Alethea Knox and Robert Whitehead. Flex's journey to stardom commenced during his teenage years when he dazzled audiences with his nimble footwork and acrobatic prowess in New York's bustling nightclubs. It was during this time that he earned the nickname Flex. The pivotal moment in Flex's career arrived when DJ Spinderella recognized his exceptional talent and invited him to join the esteemed rap trio Salt and Peppa. For three electrifying years, Flex enthralled audiences nationwide as part of the dynamic dance troupe leaving an indelible mark on the music industry. Yet Flex's talents extended far beyond the realm of dance. He lent his choreography skills to luminaries such as Mary J. Blige and Queen Latifah, further solidifying his reputation as a versatile entertainer. In 1989, Flex embarked on a new frontier, making his debut in stand-up comedy. His innate comedic flair and magnetic stage presence endeared him to audiences, paving the way for a transition into the world of acting. His silver screen debut came in 1992 with the film Juice, marking the beginning of a prolific acting career. Television beckoned, offering Flex a platform to showcase his diverse talents. His first major television role came in the form of the short-lived ABC sitcom Where I Live in 1993 alongside the talented Doug E. Doug. Despite critical acclaim, the series met an untimely end, setting the stage for Flex's relocation to Los Angeles in 1995 to pursue his acting ambitions. In 1996, Flex seized the lead role in the sitcom Homeboys in Outer Space, albeit briefly, as the series failed to resonate with audiences and was soon canceled. Undeterred, Flex continued to explore new opportunities, starring in the short-lived series Total Security later that year, created by the renowned Steven Bochco. Flex's indomitable spirit and unwavering dedication to his craft propelled him forward leading to guest appearances on popular shows like Brooklyn South and The Parkers. His filmography expanded with roles in various movies, including the 1998 direct-to-video releases, Backroom Bodega Boys, and She's All That in 1999. From 2000 to 2001, Flex Alexander graced television screens as Maya Wilkes' beloved husband, Darnell, in the inaugural season of the UPN sitcom Girlfriends. His portrayal of the supportive spouse endeared him to audiences, showcasing his versatility as an actor. However, 
Alexander made a pivotal decision to depart from girlfriends to embark on a new journey as the central character in the UPN sitcom One on One. One on One, an American sitcom that graced UPN screens from September 3rd, 2001 to May 15th, 2006, captivated audiences with its heartwarming narrative and relatable characters. At the center of the show was Flex Alexander, portraying the charismatic and sometimes flawed character of Flexter, Flex, Barnes Washington. Flex's journey was one marked by trials and triumphs, providing viewers with a glimpse into the complexities of modern family life. Born to Richard and Eunice. Barnes, Flex was the eldest of three siblings, navigating the highs and lows of adulthood with humor and resilience. In his youth, Flex's reputation with women preceded him, earning the ire of many fathers in his neighborhood. However, his life took a profound turn when he met Nicole in high school, embarking on a tumultuous journey of love and responsibility. Their relationship took a significant turn when Nicole became pregnant during their senior year, leading to marriage and the birth of their daughter, Brianna. Despite dreams of a career in the NBA, Flex's aspirations were derailed by a debilitating knee injury, prompting a career change to sports broadcasting in Baltimore. As Flex navigated the complexities of single parenthood, his romantic entanglements added layers of drama to his already tumultuous life. From his 30-day rule for relationships to his tumultuous romance with Natalie, Brianna's art teacher, Flex's journey was fraught with challenges and self-discovery. Amidst the chaos, Flex found solace in his relationship with Danielle, a psychotherapist whose initial reluctance to date him due to professional boundaries eventually blossomed into a deep and meaningful connection. As their relationship flourished, so did Flex's career with his show, The Flex Feels, syndicated to weeder audiences. In the show's fifth season, One on One underwent a transformation, refining its premise and bidding farewell to Flex as a series regular. However, his presence continued to resonate with occasional appearances as a recurring character, showcasing the enduring impact of his character on the show's narrative arc. Flex Alexander's portrayal of Flex Barnes Washington garnered critical acclaim, earning him three Nay CP Image Awards nominations and two Beat Comedy Awards nominations, a testament to his ability to breathe life into complex characters and resonate with audiences on a profound level. In 2004, he took on the formidable task of portraying the legendary Michael Jackson in the VH1 television biographical film, Man in the Mirror, The Michael Jackson Story. His role earned him another NAACP Image Award nomination, demonstrating his ability to bring iconic characters to life. What makes Alexander's portrayal different is his refusal to use prosthetics, instead choosing to embody Jackson through meticulous imitation of his voice, demeanor, and even makeup to lighten his tone, his skin color. Alexander's role not only affirmed his talent, but also his respect for Jackson's legacy. As he refrained from passing judgment on the singer's legal troubles at the time, favoring empathy and understanding instead. After his time in the biopic, Alexander returned to the small screen with renewed vigor, taking on the role in One on One for two more seasons. However, when the show was rebooted for its final season, his character underwent changes, was written out, and reduced to a recurring role, signaling a new chapter in Alexander's career. After the conclusion of One on One, Alexander ventured into the world of cinema, starring in popular films such as Snakes on a Plane, 2006, alongside the esteemed Samuel L. Jackson, and the film horror The Hill Has Eyes, 2, 2007. He also showed off his talent in Clement Virgo's Poor Boys Game, sharing the screen with veteran actor Danny Glover. His foray into television continued with a guest appearance in a 2007 episode of CSI Miami, further cementing his reputation as a versatile actor capable of taking on diverse roles across different media. In 2014, Alexander embarked on a new adventure with his wife, Shanice, as they entered the world of reality television with their own show, Flex and Shanice, which debuted November 1st on Oprah Winfrey Network, Owen. The show gives viewers a candid look at their lives, showing the joys and challenges of balancing family and career in the spotlight. In a notable twist in 2022, Alexander was cast as Pookie in the stage adaptation of New Jack City Live On Stage, a production by the urban playwright and producer film directed by Jacarius Johnson. 
The production, which is currently touring nine cities, is a testament to Alexander's enduring appeal and ability to captivate audiences both on screen and on stage. Personal life and financial matters. Flex Alexander's life journey has been a roller coaster of triumphs and challenges, marked by resilience and determination. A devout Christian, he exchanged vows with R&B sensation Shanice Wilson on February 19, 2000, beginning a journey of love and commitment. Together, they welcomed two beautiful children into the world, daughter Imani Shekinah Knox, born on August 23, 2001, and son Elijah Alexander Knox, born on March 5, 2004. Alexander's association with the Society Phi Beta Sigma fraternity further emphasized his commitment to community and brotherhood. However, behind the glitz and glamour of Hollywood lies a story of hardship and financial instability. In an interview with Yahoo, Mandy Woodruff of the Finance Department, Alexander candidly revealed the harsh realities of his financial journey, admitting his financial ignorance led to dire consequences. Their financial fortunes look bright as Flex brings in an impressive $25,000 per week from his show. However, when UPN decided to end one-on-one -on -one after five seasons in 2006, their world was turned upside down. Left with leftover checks from playback and sales of Shanice's music, they struggle to make ends meet as debt mounts and financial pressures escalate. Despite earning a staggering $1,300,000 at one point, the couple remained mired in debt, the result of uncontrolled spending and risky investments. In the challenging aftermath of the financial crisis of 2008, the Anderson family found themselves navigating treacherous waters. With their resources dwindling, they resorted to drastic measures, refinancing their home and tapping into retirement funds just to keep their heads above water. However, by 2010, their struggles reached a breaking point as they faced the grim reality of foreclosure looming over their home. Forced to confront the harsh truth of their financial situation, the Andersons made the difficult decision to file for bankruptcy, a last resort measure that would entail liquidating their assets, including cherished possessions like jewelry and cars. Despite the daunting odds stacked against them, the Andersons refused to succumb to despair. Instead, they chose to confront their adversity head on finding strength and unity as they banded together with other family members facing similar financial hardships. Reflecting on their journey, Flex and Shanice acknowledged the pitfalls of managing their finances. Flex, accustomed to living a comfortable life, admitted to overspending and neglecting taxes, while Shanice, raised in the music industry, relied heavily on others to manage her finances. Their story of resilience and redemption reached its climax in November 2014 when they emerged from bankruptcy stronger and wiser than ever. With humility and determination, they faced their mistakes and charted a new path toward financial stability. Not only is he a person who has overcome all difficulties and adversities and has acting talent, but he also has a kind heart when participating in supporting many charitable organizations in many different positions. Philanthropy. Flex Alexander and Shanice Wilson, beloved entertainers and philanthropists, have consistently demonstrated their commitment to giving back to the community through various charitable endeavors. One notable event showcasing their dedication to philanthropy was their attendance at the MJCI celebration in January 2009. Held at the opulent one and only Ocean Club Golf Course on Paradise Island, the Michael Jordan Celebrity Invitational Golf Tournament, MJCI, attracts luminaries from the worlds of sports and entertainment. The tournament serves not only as a venue for competition, but also as a platform for participating in numerous charity events. Over its seven-year history, the MJCI has raised an impressive $4 million for various worthy causes. This year alone, more than $500,000 was raised for charities such as the Butch Kersner Summit Foundation, the Make-A-Wish Foundation, and the James R. Jordan Foundation, among others, with the active involvement of celebrities in the nomination process. In May 2013, Flex Alexander and Shanice Wilson Knox organized a celebrity golf outing at the Muskegon Country Club to support Muskegon Family Care's new program, the Wellness Center Edition. Sheila Bridges, the CEO of Muskegon Family Care, highlighted the nonprofit facility's vital role in providing medical, dental, behavioral health, and pharmacy services to the community, particularly for individuals with government health benefits or those without insurance. Fast forward to November 2021 where Flex and Shanice Alexander were slated to host. The Inspiring Community Solidarity Awards presented by the San Diego Community Support 
SDCA. Amid the backdrop of the COVID-19 pandemic, SDCA sought to recognize the unsung heroes and charitable organizations that have rallied to support communities in need. Xavier Mitchell, the founder of SDCA, emphasized the importance of acknowledging these local heroes as the backbone of society, expressing gratitude and solidarity in the face of adversity. In December 2023, Flex Alexander made a significant move to Los Angeles, accompanied by his wife, Shanice. Their new residence boasts a cozy 1074 square feet featuring two bedrooms and two bathrooms. With monthly expenses estimated at a whopping $500,000, it's clear that their lifestyle demands considerable financial resources. As for transportation, Flex relies on his trusty Maruti Suzuki, a car he acquired back in 2015 during the initial advertisement and launch phase by Maruti Suzuki. Through Flex Alexander's story, they have shown us lessons about financial management and how they admirably overcome difficulties in life together. Let us know how you feel today by leaving your comments below. We hope you found this video useful. Don't forget to leave a like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you like it. Thank you for watching this video and see you in the next videos. Goodbye.